Hi, I'm Yusuf. In this video, we will machine the chamfers, all the big chamfers and small chamfers. We can machine small chamfers uh, with the mill side, but if we machine with the side, there will be radius uh, on this part. So we will machine it with the bottom. Create operation, mill planner. Face, a full red wall. D10, okay. We just select the floor. Click OK. We want just one, just one pass on the surface. So we choose passes and one. And we choose the vector. We click generate. As you can see, it finds the uh, angle by its own. We didn't define anything. Okay. Copy and paste. Generate past. We just change the floor. Generate and the last floor and click generate. Okay. It's time for small chamfers. Uh, we can't machine with the bottom of the tool because uh, the four axis machine won't allow this. So we will machine it uh, with a chamfer, chamfer mill and we will use surface area. It's a spot drill, but it seems like a chamfer mill. It's not important if you uh, define the values correctly. We choose the geometry. Okay. We click OK. Zig. Zero. Cut direction. We choose the bottom of the surface, tolerance, and display. We can see that tool is moving just uh, on the lower, uh, lower corner, lower edge of the surface. Tool axis and tool axis is minus set. And we click generate. Oh, we forgot something. We must flip the material to the uh, space. Okay. It seems correct, but we must slide the tool to the bottom. How we will do this? We will write minus 100. It means that uh, expand the surface a uh, hundred surf a hundred percent. We click OK and we generate. Now we can see that it slides the tool uh, above the lower surface. We click OK. Non-critic moves. 
engage and linear okay I will not machine all the uh, small chamfers because there are too much chamfers <clears throat> I'll machine this uh, one and finish the video I choose it click OK I flip the material uh, cut direction and leverage zig zero just one pass I can see no uh, click OK Tool axis, tool axis is minus y. <clears throat> and now I will expand the tool pads. Actually, expand the surface. Click. Uh, I will expand it, not just a hundred. Click OK, click OK, and generate. And make the linear engage. Uh, you cannot make it as easily as this operation, uh, chamfer uh, link, because it uh, it. Uh, it can see the surface and workpiece. You can expand the tool. You can make engage and retract. So it's really easy, according to planar mill or other things. It's all for this video. Thank you uh, for watching. If you have questions, please ask me on comments. Uh, also, if you like, please press like button. And if you haven't subscribed yet, please subscribe.